I'm very optimistic about what's just happened today. And right now it's just all going so fast, so we're not really realizing what it is, but by next week we'll be able to sit down and say, you know what, we're first year anniversary, Pokemon Go's come a long way. Still a lot of crashes and whatnot, but as I was discussing with the boy down there earlier, um, I think that's a lot to do with the, with the network, you really can't really blame, blame it all on uh, Niantic. And I'm not sticking up for them here at all, but I'm just saying how I feel um, from the little knowledge that I have on uh, IT. System, you mean? No, new system. I new system. I get the 350 usually. Just oh go out and get 50 a day. But I'm not as hardcore into, into the gyms as I used to be. I'll defend my area, but I won't like, you know, I'll put a Pokemon into one or knock one down if there's like not much effort needed. Right, guys. Uh, we just been doing some raids now. Um, just trying to enjoy the, the city really at this point. 
because you know the game just keeps crashing and there's still what half an hour to the next um, slot. Let me start on my champ on a level three raid because I didn't want to use a golden raspberry, which is probably a good choice actually, considering it was just a level three my champ. Should have turned out into a fifteen hundred so my champ uh, after the raid. So yeah, good stuff there, boys. Um, my phone keeps crashing, but apart from that, it's fine, yeah. <laughs> We're We're to go. <laughs> the scenes are amazing, boys. Every corner you look is Pokemon Go players. From tops to little side walks, stairs, gardens. Literally, we've taken over the town. Like, everywhere you look is just Pokemon Go players. Trying to hustle up some. Last minute XP, catch rare Pokemon, raid, all of that. 20 minutes now until the second wave. <laughs> don't be annoyed if I don't get one in the end. Do you have one of them? Yeah. Do you mind being on camera? Yeah, I do. Have no. loads. So, how did you enjoy the event? I mean, it's been fun, but it's a bit annoying and crashing and all that. Yeah, no, definitely, man. And the lagging as well. Yeah. And the rain. Let's be fair, I think the rain kind of killed it as well. Don't you think? I mean, <laughs> if, if I'm going to be honest, I was a little bit glad for the rain because there's less people and it seems to be crashing less now. So, I don't know. Okay. It worked out, it worked out better, but yeah, I don't know. It probably would have been overall better without the rain, yeah. Yeah, definitely. I, I mean, I think, like, could you imagine like this turnout without the rain? And without the game crashing. Yeah, I know that. That'd be an absolute awesome. And if there was, I was saying, I was saying some, something to someone like, can you imagine if there was something that could have united us all in the same square for at least like, I don't know, half an hour? Well, like, like some so kind of like, activity or something? Yeah, I mean, even if they just had like, if they set up a, um, a gym that had a raid spawning on it yeah. as soon as the last one went away or something, so it would just yeah. always have a tier 3 or 4 on it or something yeah. like that. Would be kind of cool. Or, of course, Legendaries. <laughs> yeah. I think that will reunite. Yeah, if we get, is, is if that, we get are, one you, are you are you hearing what I'm hearing? I'm on the road to Viridian City. These guys are absolute legends. Is it you? Is it you guys playing that? <laughs> you guys are absolute legends. Can you play the Misty song? <laughs> <laughs> I'll see if I've got it. <laughs> Alright guys, by now I'm sure you've all heard of what's happening at Chicago um, Pokemon Go Fest, um, so there's no need to go over that again. Basically what we're doing here in Chester is just wrapping up the day, 9 o'clock, all the last eggs are hatching for the raids. Um, nothing really too interesting around, but the town does look beautiful right now, like it's really quiet. It's just, it's just moments worth seeing. Right now. Like, honestly, no bitterness over here. Most people are just having a laugh, um, just enjoying their time here. Really, good vibes all around. And uh, it's five past nine right now. So, those who do have any battery left, they are carrying on catching Pokemon, trying to support whatever's left over at Chicago. Uh, our hearts go out to them. Uh, we heard, you know, that a lot of people were distressed and were asking for refunds and whatnot. So, um, yeah, we're trying our best here to keep supporting them. It's not been very easy for us here at all, us ourselves. But obviously, we didn't pay for uh, the ticket to come in. We didn't have as high expectations as them. So, um, I suppose I can't compare myself to. Uh, we can't compare ourselves to what's happening in Chicago. Do you guys want to say hi to the camera? <laughs> I just see these guys looking here. Um, a celeb, you're famous. <laughs> oh look, it's a Pikachu. <laughs> That's a weird Pikachu. <laughs> Very cute though. <laughs> How did you guys enjoy it? Is it good? Yeah, we loved it. We've had a really good day. Right. Manchester. We've never been here before, so it's yes. been good exploring the city. And yeah, we're having a good time. That's exactly what I've been saying, yeah. Um, you know, despite the weather and uh, whatever else has been happening, it's still a great vibe, isn't it? Yeah, it's been really good, and we've yeah. had some really good experiences meeting new people. We've made exactly. um, we've made some new friends, so yeah, no, exactly. we've had a great That's time. Nice. <laughs> Cheers, man. Thank you, guys.
Yes. So, as you can see, like, honestly, I'm not even, like, trying to make up stuff. Like, the vibe is generally, generally like, good here. Um, again, as I said, it might be to do with the fact that um, people have just come here with not much expectations. Um, it was kind of like a last minute event, honestly, the Chester event. Um, it was a free event. Um, and it was also attached to an historical event, like it wasn't a purely Pokemon Go event. Um, so yeah, um, again, we're gonna be sticking around most probably, me, um, Elizabeth and Irene, uh, and waiting for what's going to happen at midnight, see if there's going to be any good news coming out. Uh, I really, really do hope there will be good news because I do want a legendary, or at least have a chance at catching legendary. Um, I'll be keeping you guys uh, updated on that and I'll get a review for you guys on the way as soon as possible, really. <laughs> what happened? Are you getting errors as well? We just, we just can't do it anymore. We're tired. We've been out since about five in the morning aggregate got some rest in between and it's been a pretty successful day now there are unofficial reports and i'm saying unofficial because i don't think pokemon go hub is as official as it's made up to be that and they certainly confirmed confirmed it right now by claiming that lugia is out and there is also another update or something um, that will have new items in the in the in the, in the poke uh, shop, and um, also Articuno apparently will be available to catch as a second legendary Pokemon because Mystic have one. We have one. Not surprised at all. We are the best team by far, guys. Let's be honest, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> and um, so yeah, um, that's unofficial. Um, what's official though is that I am going to sleep right now because I am so tired the original plan was to wait for the US um, event to finish up which should be around midnight in our time their event their final event will start then where they will be able to catch a legendary Pokemon but uh, following the events of tonight I don't think that's going to be happening so I'm just going to go home and catch up on everything that's happened tomorrow guys Searching for you. Never found. Never found. I was searching for you. Never found. 